I have Matt, and yes, I'm sitting on the toilet, but I'm not using it. I'm just sitting on it. This is another spine tingling home inspection video. Uh, so today, oh wait, that light's not on. So that light only comes on when the fan's on. Okay, let's leave it off because of the sound. So one of the issues that pops up in a home inspection, this is a, a flip. You know, someone has renovated this and they're selling it. So this water is pretty cold. Here's my thermometer, 72 degrees, move it over, move it over some more, I'm trying to find a sweet spot, I get a little bit of warm water, but see then the water pressure starts to drop too, so it gets warmer but the pressure drops a lot. And the more I push it, the more I push it that way to get it warmer, the more the pressure drops. So let's see what it is now. 81, which most people probably would not think that was hot enough to take a shower in. Over here at the faucet, just to show you. Yeah. On this particular thermometer I'm holding. I think you're supposed to hold it far. See the dots? You're supposed to hold it far enough away so when the dots come together that's the right place. So when the dots are right on top of each other I'm getting 101, 107, jumping around a lot. So it's a lot warmer. The dots are farther apart. So that's how this one works. Anyway, so we can't get the water nearly as hot over here as we do with the faucet. So what I think is going on here, there's an anti-scald valve in here. And we're not going to go into it, but there's uh, several good YouTube videos on how to remove that so you can get more hot water out of here. So it must be a law or something, you know, the federal government probably said they had to put those in uh, from the manufacturer. And then if you can take them out, you can take them out. So if you this is just about why this happens for home inspectors. But if you go on uh, YouTube and search on remove anti-scald valve, there's different videos on how to do it for different brands of, uh, of uh, faucets. So this is something that pops up and happened once before. I got a call from some guy who was upset. He goes, you know, you didn't check the, there's no hot water in the second floor bathroom. You didn't check it. So, you know, I did check it and, uh, you know, it just, it wasn't very warm and, you know, it had one of those anti-scald valves in as all it was and I, I told him to go on YouTube and see how to remove it, you know. It's, so this is something I write up now, something I may not have written up in the past so much, but now I'm really on top of that. So I see more and more of this all the time. The first time it popped up was uh, maybe about 10 years ago when I was inspecting a house. But I see them more and more late, especially in the last year, I would say, people installing those things with the anti-scald valve still on. So anyway, that's it. Anti-scald valve, it's got to be removed.